Okay, so Kim, the night manager, went on maternity leave, and her husband's name is Sandy, right? So get this. Her replacement is a woman named Sandy whose husband's name is Kim. <laughs> wow. I know. What are the odds? Oh. Easily calculable. We begin by identifying the set of married couples with unisex names. We then eliminate those unqualified for restaurant work, you know, the aged, the imprisoned, and the limbless, for example. Next, we look at the set Sheldon. of people with... It's an amazing coincidence. Can we leave it at that? I'm sorry. Oh, Penny. It's as if the Cheesecake Factory is run by witches. Uh, Sheldon, it's as if you don't think I'll punch you. Come on, you guys, let it go. Fine, whatever. Are you finished? Well, thank you. How thoughtful. Would you like a chocolate? Um, yeah, sure. <laughs> Thanks. What was that? You said be nice to Penny. I believe offering chocolate to someone falls within the definition of nice. It does, but in my experience, you don't. There are more things in heaven and earth, Horatio, than are dreamt of in your philosophy. Uh, yeah, that's you, obnoxious and insufferable. <laughs> What's going on, day dwellers? Oh, man, did the kiss army repeal don't ask, don't tell? No. Raj and I are going to a goth club in Hollywood to hang with the night people. Anybody want to come along? Oh, wow. You're actually going out like that? No. No, I'm going out like this. Uh, Howard, what did you do? They're called tattoo sleeves. Look. <laughs> yeah, I bought them online. Raj got a set, too. <laughs> Fantastic, right? Put them on, have hot sex with some freaky girl with her business peers, take them off, and I can still be buried in a Jewish cemetery. I always wanted to go to a goth nightclub. Really? Bazinga. <laughs> None of you ever see my practical jokes coming, do you? Okay, how about you two? Look, I got some extra tat sleeves. Why are you carrying extras? <laughs> In case I snag one on someone's nipple ring. Uh, yeah, I think we'll pass. Oh, is the missus speaking for the couple now? In this case, you bet she is. Yes, she's pushy, and yes, he's whipped, but that's not the expression. Come on, I want to stop at Walgreens and pick up some more eyeliner. They're going to get beaten up at that club. They're going to get beaten up at Walgreens. Oh, sorry, Sheldon, I almost sat in your spot. Did you? I didn't notice. Have a chocolate. Thank you.